In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change the date format and language settings in Google Drive, a skill that can be quite useful if you're working in different regions or collaborating with international teams. Whether you're organizing your own documents or handling shared files, ensuring that everyone can read and understand the date format correctly is crucial. To get started, head over to your Google Drive homepage. You can do this by opening your web browser and navigating to the Google Drive site. Once you're there, locate the specific Google Sheets file you want to adjust the settings for. Simply select or open that file. Next, you'll want to access the file settings within Google Sheets. Look for the File option located at the top left corner of the window. Click on it and a drop down menu will appear. This is your gateway to all the document configuration options. From this menu, go ahead and select Settings. This is where you can control various aspects related to your files formatting and regional adaptation. After clicking on Settings, you'll notice a side pane that opens with several customizable elements. Now let's move on to changing the locale. In the Settings pane, locate and click on the Locale option. This setting dictates how numbers, dates and times are treated in the document, so choosing the right locale ensures that all your data is formatted correctly for your region. Next, find the time zone section. Selecting the correct time zone is important for tracking edits and understanding when changes were made. It also influences the timestamps in spreadsheet formulas that rely on date and time data. After you've adjusted the locale and time zone to suit your needs, it's time to save your changes. To do this, simply look for the Save Settings button, usually found towards the bottom of the settings pane. Click on it to confirm and apply your new preferences. And there you have it, you've successfully updated the date format and language settings for your Google Drive file. With these precise adjustments, you can ensure a smoother workflow and better collaboration, regardless of where your team members are located across the globe. Remember, you can always revisit these settings if needed to make further adjustments, especially when transitioning to new projects or teams. Familiarizing yourself with these options is a great way to maintain clarity and consistency in your documents. Thanks for tuning in, and I hope this video helped simplify the process of managing your Google Drive settings. Be sure to check out more of our guides and tips to keep enhancing your productivity.